Bull case, bear case is best case for what AI can do for the world, and what do you fear most? Well, look, the, 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 the best case scenario that, that I've always dreamed about and why I've worked my whole life on, on, on AI and, and you know, getting closer to this moment we've been working towards for decades now, many of us, is a, a kind of, I have something to call it radical abundance. So this idea we solved a lot of the biggest issues confronting uh, society and humanity today. So whether that's free, uh, renewable, clean energy, maybe we solve fusion or better battery, optimal batteries and, and solar uh, materials, uh, semiconductors, you know, material science. We've solved a lot of diseases. So then we're in a situation where, you know, we're in this new era, post-scarcity era, and we're potentially, you know, humanity is, is, is flourishing and traveling to the stars and spreading consciousness to the, to the galaxy. And what do you fear most? Uh, well, even that utopian kind of view has some questions around it about what will be our purpose as humans if there are these technologies and that are out there that are solving all these problems, yes. what will be left to solve? Yes. You know, I worry about that as a scientist and you know, the scientific method even. So there's that, but there's also obviously the, the well-known uh, challenges and risks with AI of, well, twofold. One is bad actors uh, using AI for harmful ends, um, or the AI itself, as it gets closer to AGI and becomes more agentic, uh, it goes off the rails in some way that harms humanity. So. You